Hey guys, it's me, Goldie. I managed to get a big gorilla game and thought it was worth sharing. I know many people underestimate the gorilla, so I wanna showcase its power. It's definitely not one of the best units in the game, but it's better than people think. Hope you enjoyed the video, thank you, bye! Okay. So, if we get uh, early hedgehogs, then I think it's a good idea to get them now. To be without they come. Sour. Oh god, chipmunks, beavers, bees. Okay, we can go with sour, man. No no taste related uh, nouns, please. Oh, wait, that's not a noun. Adjective? Is that what it's called in English? This is definitely a noun. I'm not sure if this is an adjective. I'm actually curious. Give me one sec. Adjectives. Oh, actually, it, it actually is called an adjective in English, because it's called an adjective in Romanian as well. Well, technically it's called adjective, but, it, but it's literally the same word. Hey Davila, hello my friend. What is the most metal build right now? Hmm... That's a tough question, Richmond. It's actually a tough question. I don't think there's... Well, there technically there has to be uh, the most mellow build because there has to be one that sees the most play But I don't know what it, what it is man like there's not one build that people are spamming now Honestly like there was before with the total rooster build. Oh my god. What's up with this guy? Jesus Okay, we still win The melon saved us. Let's go. Or the dog for now, I think we do this. The snake would definitely be more powerful behind the dog, but we have to go like this. Or the duck build. Those were the main metal pills last patch, but now, I don't know, I don't think there's one main uh, strong team, honestly, not team, but comp. Okay, we'll definitely get this. Yeah, or if if there is one, I'm just not aware of it, but honestly, I've been, I've, no, no, I should, if there was one, I would have known, because I'm playing a lot of, uh, a lot of Sprout pets. I would have, uh, I would have observed if uh, a lot of people played the same build or something. So yeah, now it's just a uh, a big happy omelet of builds. People are trying stuff out. It's cool, man. I mean, it depends on how much time there's uh, gonna be between this patch and next patch, but. Uh, If there's gonna be at least as much time as there was between last patch and the patch that is now, we should definitely be seeing some uh, some dominant builds soon, I think. Because uh, after the dust settles from uh, from all the people trying so much stuff out, there's definitely gonna be some uh, strong teams that emerge out of out of all the experimentation and stuff, man. So yeah, I think we should enjoy this uh, as much as we can now, because now we can just play anything, I guess. Because uh, yeah. I used to hate the uh, uh, the last two weeks of last patch, man. I was having no fun. The people, everyone was spamming the Dodo Rooster, man. I was trying out uh, new stuff, trying to come out with cool, I don't know, cool, like uh, with the uh, Hedgehog Blowfish. I was trying stuff out and I was just getting stomped, man, by the Dodo Rooster. You, you just had no chance against them. If you weren't running it yourselves, yourself, you, you were just dead. So. Thank god they nerfed it. And I'm so happy they nerfed it to extension, man. I'm so happy. I don't ever want to see a Dodo or a Rooster ever again. And yes, I am guilty of uh, spamming it as well. I am. I've played with it a million times. I'm happy to admit. I'm, uh, I'm embarrassed to admit that. Not happy. 
Okay. Give me a level up. Okay, that's one. Oh, and that's why I don't like the early dog, man. I mean, it's a really good drop, but... <laughs> I've played, like... A million dog builds, man. Well, to be honest, I think the num the wheel number should be between 50 and 100, man. I've spammed the dog build. It was so easy to win. Just get uh, less flash, just get at least three dogs in the first two rounds, sell all of them, get the dog, and just snowball to, to 10 wins really fast. Yeah, but I guess we can we can get it now. And we keep this guy. And I think a swan is amazing. Because that means we have more gold for the cycling. Yeah. You all probably know how the dog build goes. You just buy just buy everything and sell everything again. A shrimp goes well with this team as well. Okay, we're definitely gonna lose this round. Okay, it was pretty close, but close doesn't count, so I'll just take the L. Okay. Wait. Okay, now we got a, now we got a choice to make. Do we sell this this fish to make sure that the ant buff goes 100% to the dog, or do we just take the 50/50? Well, if we sell the fish, we get 13 gold. We use the we use the pill. That's 12 gold, and we need to buy four units, which we would have enough gold, but there's only three units in the shop. Okay, let's take the 50/50. Please. Nice, okay. Fifty percent of the time it works every time. Let's go. Okay. Okay, now we have an eight six dog. It's I don't think it's enough to, to win us this next round, but who knows it might be. Would have been nicer if it had more HP than attack, because uh, 8 attack is definitely overkill. It would have uh, benefited from, yeah, it dies in one shot. We're probably gonna lose. Okay, yeah. And he still had a sheep in the back to make sure he wins. Okay. Buy everything, sell everything. The beaver is amazing because you get 2 HP as well when you sell it. The pig is amazing because it technically costs you 1 gold. Might as well. This is definitely worth getting. I'll keep the second one as well. I'm not sure who we're going to use it on though. Okay, a rabbit and a camel. That's interesting. But the thing is, if, you, if, you're, going for a, if you're going for a dog build, you're not going to buy food. You you will spend your money on units, so so the rabbit is not useful because you don't have money to buy both units and food. Okay, I like it. I don't think we need this, and we don't need any of these units, so we won't freeze them. I like this one, but with level one, it's not that impactful. Gotta go have fun, guys. Okay, Jules, thank you so much for coming in, man. Hopefully, you will. Uh, Hopefully we'll talk again. I will be streaming tomorrow as well. I'm streaming Monday to Friday. Same time. But thank you for coming in and for the generosity, man. Thank you. Okay, I think this is worth getting. But wait, let me sell this guy. We get the swan, so that's one more buff, and then we combine them. Because if you combine them straight away, that doesn't buff the dog. Okay, I guess just buy everything and just keep the ox as our last unit. Okay. Our priority right now. Oh, wait, we haven't unlocked it. Yeah. Okay, we unlocked the dog on round seven. Yeah. No. No, we, we unlocked it already. Okay. So, I think, I think we should be rolling now for the dogs. Because a level two dog would be basically doubling the scaling accelerating it making it twice as fast 
What the dog doing? <laughs> if we're actually asking what the dog does, he gets plus one attack or plus one HP when whenever we summon a unit. So basically, we're uh, we're using uh, our money every round to just buy as many units as we can so that the dog uh, grows. And we have the synergy with the shrimp, which uh, when we sell a, a unit, we get plus one HP on a random unit, which isn't that great because buffing this fish or this one is pretty much terrible. But if it hits the dog, that's pretty good value. I don't think we keep the shrimp. I don't think we commit to get it to level two. We just want to get more units. And if, the, if more dogs pop up, we get it, that unit to level two, not the shrimp. We'll definitely keep this for the next round. Pet dog can be healthy. Don't worry, he's not fat dumb. He's just buff. He goes to the gym. Okay. Damn, no. That's a pretty good unit. Pavard doesn't help us. Okay, we have 2 HP left, so I guess the dog, the dog strat hasn't worked out too well for us. I don't like it. <laughs> what do we buy, man? We need one more unit. That doesn't do anything. A sheep? Okay, so basically, if this dog dies, we're, we're dead as well. I think he dead. <laughs> Wait. We might actually... That's a level 2 deer, come on. Oh, never mind. Okay, the dog was big enough to win us the round. I don't think we transition to a... Over and build. I don't think that's the play. Ooh. Okay, fuck it. I'll use it. Mm. Oh, this is so bad. I guess we buy the blowfish that has most stats. Okay. That's pretty bad. Our. Not even backline, man. Our. <laughs> Four units suck. Okay, wait. This guy might be a problem. Wait, yeah, he is a problem. The melon. No, the garlic, no! Nice. Oh my god, okay. Damn. That garlic, man. Definitely don't want another sheep. Level 2 blowfish. Oh man, it's so late for a level 2 dog. Do we spend our money on this just to get a level up? Mm. It's pretty risky because that's 6 gold invested. If we don't get anything good, then we're kind of screwed. I don't think we do it. We can't... Uh, we can't afford to risk that much. Okay, that's honestly what I was looking for. Nice. Go for a big gorilla. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's give the gorilla a chance. Okay, I like it. Nice! <laughs> Don't need this. Okay, I guess we keep the gorilla in front. With the level 2 monkey, that's pretty good. Okay, we need to do this. We need as much help as we can. We could have rolled twice, I guess, yeah. Okay. What does Coconut Shield do? It protects the Gorilla from, uh, from one instance of damage. It's technically a melon, but it doesn't have the, the cap 
Like the melon only only protects you from 20 damage, the coconut shield protects you from any amount of damage. I guess we won. Get this out of the way. Mushroom, don't need it. Please give me another gorilla. I guess, just get some more stats. Okay, this gorilla scaled really fast with that level 2 monkey in the back. Wait, this song is actually pretty annoying. Okay. Ooh. Wait! The coconut! Yes! I guess that's a counter to the mushroom. Uh... Oh, that's actually a counter to the to the mushroom scorpion, man. Because the first, the first scorpion with the mushroom gives you the coconut. And that protects you from the... The second scraper with the poison on it. Please, level 2 gorilla, that's all I ask. Okay, thank you. So now it gets two coconut shields. Wow, okay. I have never had a gorilla this big. And yeah, and I guess this uh, dolphin is pretty good for us because uh, it snipes. Uh, it snipes scorpions. Pretty good. But wait, if he has a scorpion with a mushroom, it snipes the scorpion with the mushroom, which makes the scorpion with the poison attack the gorilla and it dies. Ugh. Which is why we're gonna buy this. Okay. 4849 gorilla. Let's go. What would you say is the dream build? Hmm. It depends the villa. It depends, cause uh, everyone has different dreams, right? Okay, the gorilla is actually killing everything. Nice hat, thank you, Saptaishi. <laughs> we don't need more stats. I guess my dream build of villa would, is, would be a food center build, man. Like all five units be food centered. And by that I mean a worm, a cat, cow, seal, maybe a rabbit, but nah. Because rabbit is pretty bad in late game. Swan maybe? Yeah, swan would be decent because you have you have more more gold to buy uh, to buy food. It's pretty good. Okay, I could use the melon on this guy, I guess. Ooh. Okay, I guess this is the perfect opportunity to get the gorilla to level three, man. Or chipmunk. Oh, there we go. Oh, it, it gets sniped anyway. Okay, nice. Oh man, this is so strong. Okay, give me the level 3 gorilla, man. Please. We have 3 rolls. Please make it happen. We can't roll one more time. Cause, wait, twice. Because we can sell the monkey. Surprise, yes. motherfucker! Yes, let's go! Yes! Okay, please win this round. We're probably never gonna get the level 3 gorilla again. Please win this round. Oh my god, this guy's strong. We get the coconut. No! <laughs> The dream is dead. The dream is dead. Yikes. Yikes indeed, man. I'm actually so sad, man. I'm never gonna get another 50-50 gorilla with level 3 on it. Well, the level 3 technically isn't on it. It has level 3. I'll be a rampage.